Watch on fire. 400 block. We definitely have injured. Start the event. A Michigan man has died of his injuries after Saturday's mass shooting on 6th Street. We need a lot more 25-year-old Douglas Cantor was in Austin visiting friends. A recent Michigan State graduate continuing his education at the University of Michigan. His family says he was looking forward to marrying his high school sweetheart of 10 years and starting a family. At this point, we believe all patients are being transported by APD officers. His brother, Nick Cantor, thanking Austin police officers. <laughs> Writing in a statement, the courage and quick action by the officers to put my brother in the police car and race him to the hospital nearly did save his life. We did end up requiring to have police transport, and that was part of the plan, but it's not an ideal plan. There's a huge difference in our first aid training. There's also um, a huge difference in the equipment that we carry. Austin Travis County EMS Association President Selena Shia says just four people were transported to Del Seton in an ambulance. We had about nine people, eight to nine people transported by police. Some of the 14 victims didn't come forward until later on. The street was crowded for a popular motorcycle rally. The downtown area is actually really hard to access for ambulances. During big events, Shia says medics typically use utility vehicles to zip through crowds, transporting patients to tents where ambulances are staged. But this weekend, those resources weren't in place. So at this point, I do think it's appropriate, and I'm calling for the city to have our medics in gators every single weekend night um, because that will help if we have another event like this. We know it's going to be more violent and there are going to be more crowds. 